I'm Michael Diamond. This is Muscle Central. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up, share, subscribe, turn on your notifications, and leave a comment. Okay, uh, Beirut Tabani, uh, an Iranian bodybuilder who earned his ticket to the Olympia early in the season. As of now, it's up in the air whether he'll be able to make it to the Olympia. Uh, there are issues with him getting a visa. We're only about 10 weeks away, and as of now, it doesn't look very good. And it doesn't look like he's gonna, or there's a good chance he's not gonna make it into the United States to compete on the Olympia stage. And that brings us also to Hadi Chupan. Now, I did a video a little while back uh, talking about Hadi Chupan coming to the U.S. I have a friend of mine, Iranian, follows bodybuilding, is in contact with people back in Iran, and what he was getting, what he, he was hearing is that Yes, Hadi Chupan will be leaving Iran and most likely coming to the U.S. to relocate. Now, this was a little while back, and as of now, we haven't heard anything to confirm that either way. So, now the next question is, uh, we know Beirut Tabani is having major issues securing a visa to get into the country. Hadi has gone through the same thing every single year. It was up in the air whether he was going to be able to get into the country and compete in the Olympia. Uh, not last year, I think it was the previous year, he actually landed in the U.S. within, inside of 24 hours before he was supposed to step on stage. That is down to the wire. We don't know whether he's going to, uh, Heidi's going to be able to get into the country. He's probably going to be going through the same shit that he went through the last few years. Nothing has really changed. Now, let's picture this scenario. Beirut, uh, Beirut's Tabani does not get his visa and unfortunately cannot compete in the Olympia. But Mr. Olympia doesn't get his visa either and he can't get into the U.S. Uh, to, go, to compete on the Olympia stage. Now, whoever wins... The Olympia in that scenario, there's going to be a big question mark over the win. Was the champion was not there to defend the title. If Hardy was there, would he be able to beat Hardy? Beat Hardy, and that's going to be a big question. And we saw that uh, a few years back with Brandon Curry. Sean Rode in 2018 beats Phil Heath. Becomes the Mr. Olympia. Gets a, uh, he's a, arrested. Charges brought up against him. He's awaiting trial. Uh, nothing proven against him. But the uh, they would not allow him to compete. So in 2019, Sean Roden was not allowed to step on the Olympia stage to defend his title. Brandon Curry wins the Olympia. But... Under that circumstance, there's a big question mark over Brandon's victory. The champion wasn't there. The champion wasn't allowed to compete. Would he be beating Sean Roden? We don't know. Uh, it's really a shame that this in this situation where Hardy Chupan and uh, Tabani that politics, that the issues between the government are preventing them or could prevent them from 
plying their trade, making a living. They're bodybuilders. They compete. They compete to make money. Uh, an idea, you know. I know it takes some money, but why wouldn't the IFBB and Jake Wood and the Olympia brand? Why wouldn't they be interested in taking steps to uh, help these, this process? You know, uh, I'm sure they. And it isn't, they both. The IFBB has money. And we know Jake Wood, uh, the Olympia brand, there's a lot of money behind it, behind him. I'm sure they both want to see the best bodybuilders on the stage. If you win a pro show, you deserve to be on the stage. I'm, <clears throat> excuse me. I'm sure they want to see our current champion back on the stage to defend his title. Why aren't they... As a team getting together, uh, form a, whatever you want to call it, uh, hire a group of lawyers uh, just to work on issues like this and make sure that the athlete that's qualified to compete in the Olympia, no matter where he's traveling from, is able to leave that country and get into this country to compete. Uh, I don't know. It's just an idea. Uh, like, like I said, I'm sure both parties, the IFBB and the Olympia brand, want the best on stage and they want their champion to defend the title. Uh, it's just an idea uh, you might agree or disagree with what I've said. Let me know. Uh, let me know in the comment section. I'd like to thank you for watching Muscle Central.